hello. Since most of you have probably not visited my Etsy shop or my blog, I wanted to take a moment and just talk about who I am, how I got here, and why on earth I talk about at all cloth and continence products. Because honestly, if you would have told me seven years ago I'd have my face on YouTube talking about cloth and continence products, I would that'd be I'd think you're crazy. Like, couldn't I at least talk about something cool? You know, like <laughs> anything else. But you know, that's life. You end up where you don't expect to go. And so <clears throat> here I am, right? Um, but okay. My name is Alicia. I am 35 years old. I do not have incontinence. I have two kids, ages six and nine, and a third one coming in October. My story starts seven years ago when my oldest was two and potty training. So I, I'm the type of person who is afflicted with the whole, well, if I can make it, why should I buy it sort of mentality. And so, you know, the same thing goes with you know, cloth pull-ups for my daughter. So I got a pattern, I got the fabric, and I started sewing. And I thought, well, I'm staying at home. Why not start an Etsy shop, right? Like everyone's starting an Etsy shop. And so using the pattern I bought as a guide, I created my own patterns because it's never okay to use someone else's work as your own. I mean, we're all unique, creative individuals with, you know, a voice and a perspective that the world deserves to hear and to see. So I started my Etsy shop. And since everyone and their grandma was doing baby and toddler stuff, one day someone said, you know, can you make this an adult size? And I was like, can I? I don't know, but I'll try. I don't have any sales. And so I actually bought a pair of underwear in this person's size and I sketched out a pattern and I gave it a go, you know, and it, and it worked out pretty good. So I started doing custom orders for, you know, pull-ups, trading pants, diapers, you know, for adult sizes. And so over the next year and a half, people would um, <clears throat> give me their measurements and tell me what they wanted if there was a baby item that they're like, can you make this an adult size? You know, I would read the descriptions and sketch something out. And, you know, like it was hit and miss in the beginning because there there weren't any patterns out there. I, and there wasn't any information out there on how to make adult items. And so I made a lot of mistakes and I gave a lot of refunds. And on the whole, I didn't make any money. But I learned a lot, you know, and I learned so much about, you know, people's stories and their situations and their struggles with, you know, finding alternatives to manage their incontinence that wasn't disposable. And, you know, and I learned that, you know, incontinence doesn't care your age, your gender or your race. It just doesn't care. If you have incontinence, you have incontinence and you've got to figure out a way to deal with that. And so and for a lot of people, it was embarrassing and frustrating. And so I became like this place where people could just be like, oh my gosh, I'm dealing with this. Like, I need some help. Like, what can you do? And so, you know, through that, I was inspired to start my blog, which is where, which was where I, you know, I blog about how to assess your needs, how to choose a product how to troubleshoot some issues. And I created a workshop, you know, to walk people through those things. And doing my customization work, I started to notice like, okay, what are some common requests? What are some common sizing? I created standardized patterns, you know, small, medium, large, et cetera, et cetera, you know, with a size chart and the whole nine yards, you know. And now, because there still isn't a lot of information and patterns and options available, if you do want to sew your own, you know, my dream project is to take all these patterns that I've created over. I mean, I've created hundreds of patterns. You know, some of them are duds, but you know, some of them have been tried and true and tested. Like I think I've sewn at least 500 pull-ups over the years. And I know like 
that pattern is gold. Like, it's guaranteed to fit. Like, I have never had issues with people being like, it's too small. It's too large. It doesn't work, you know? You know, if you're like me, like, you want to sew stuff. You want to make your own stuff. And you deserve to be able to do that. And so I'm so excited to start you know, to have my patterns out there. And so I'm st on YouTube and on my blog, I'm still going to be talking about, you know, things surrounding cloth and continence products, you know, using them and choosing them and troubleshooting them. But I'm, but you'll also start to see some more sewing related content and tutorials. And, you know, as my patterns come out, um, you know, information on those. And so if you are someone who sews and you are interested in knowing more, you can check the link below. If you're interested in learning about my workshop that I have, that link is also below. And of course, if you have any questions for me, feel free to comment below. With that, until next time.